welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Bay. Um, so, I eat African food, he doesn't. Um, so today he's about to learn. First for me. <laughs> so I had a struggle because I wanted to do Ghanaian. I like light pepper soup, but they were out of stock. And so um, he doesn't like okra. I like okra. So it was a bit of hard. And I don't like the trending one, which is, um, um, I don't know, that melon one. So we went for, um, ooh, this is like light pepper soup though, but it's more, mm, but the Nigerian style. Look at your face. What? <laughs> <laughs> yes, our hands I are washed. I culture when it comes to food, so I only eat a certain type of food. So this is going to be a bit different. It's not like so this is from Nollywood. They're really nice. They're on Uber Eats. They even gave us like these little hand hand wipes. I've never ate from them before. We do this Fanta too in the Caribbean. Ding, 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 ding. It's the only Fanta that I drink. So I'm gonna give Bay some some Fanta gel. <laughs> it is hot. It's like that play doh bro. I'm only gonna give you a little bit because I don't want you yeah. to waste it. Just me a little bit. Yeah. Because for me, I like this stuff. And then we've got some jell-off rice. So this is... jell -off. This is the one with the stew that reminds me of black pepper soup. I'm not sure what it is called in Nigerian. We've got jell-off rice. Shout out to my Nigerians. I like Nigerian jell-off rice. Um, so we've got some jell-off rice. And then we've got some beef stew to go with it. That looks good. Yeah, that I can relate to right there, at least. Okay, so what you do, yeah, you basically hold it and you take off a piece and you just roll it in your hands. That's hot, bro. Yeah. That's tiny. I might not like it. I'm taking a little bit of It's right? just yum. Okay. And then you just like dip it in. Mmm. Why are you chewing? You don't chew, you swallow. Oh. There's no meat. Sauce so is nice. That's a tangy. Mm. Not bad. Did you, what did you thought it was going to be like? You're going to finish that one there. Okay. <laughs> Let me have some of the chicken. This is like Ghanaian light pepper soup without the pepper. It needs pepper. Well, you don't like pepper. You can't handle pepper, but it needs nah. a bit of pepper. I like my pepper mild. Where are you going with this little? Oh my god, look at this little piece. What is that? <laughs> what is that? You pick up things like this. Okay, it's not to be big. So the flavour and everything. Of the chicken? Right. What I'll taste that by itself. Look how much it is. It's just yam, but it's pounds It's kind of a little tasteless. Not the okay. taste of it. Mm -hmm. And then like, like like dough. And then the chicken they fried and then they stew it they stewed it down. <laughs> they try to go like this. Try and try and roll it. I look prob um I'm even now in Caribbean can tell I've been around enough enough Africans. What ah what is this? <laughs> Why are you rolling it in your hand? Go like this, you pick it, yeah, and then you just push push it, use your thumb. Yes! <laughs> But it's nice, isn't it? Do you want to try? Do you want to try okra? Might as well. <laughs> I love okra stew. Gravy's nice too. That comes with a sort of. 
<clears throat> Are you actually liking it, babe? Oh, Have you oh. ever had um, that Fanta in Grenada? Probably. It's mainly like Coke. I would drink Coke. Oh, yeah. Out of the glass. Yeah, no. In Sankits, we have these. We have these bottles. And then when when we were little, we used to take them back. And they used to give us some scents. Like for recycling. Like you take the glass bottle back yeah, and yeah, you recycle yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you don't have to, to but... Those scents back then are... Mm. Mm. I think you're actually enjoying this, you know? Oh, chicken's nice. I'm not sure about the pounded yam part, but... Chicken nice. It was nice, it would be nice if it had a bit of okra. And they haven't given it enough, um, they haven't given enough, like, um, soup. What do you mean, like, gravy? It's called soup. This is soup? Not like how Caribbean soup is, but mm. this is, they call it this soup. Okay. Yeah. So, not gravy. Yes, babe. Right, and you know what? He was so like, whenever I used to order, good. he would just be like, mmm, or making up his face. Nope. <laughs> now, what he'll be like, can I have Pamela and all of this stuff? Pamela. <laughs> you need to taste, like, one thing with me, like, I have mixed friends. I have, like, close mixed Ghanaian and I have close mixed Nigerian. Now, when it comes to soups, yeah, I prefer Ghanaian soups. Like, I like their okra soup, I like their light pepper soup, that is nice. And they do, they do, ah, uh, what is it again? There's something that they do that is nice, I can't remember. It will come to me. Mm. And then like with my Ghanaians now, I like their jello fries. Their mm. jello fries and turkey, fried turkey. Ooh, that is nice. Looks like more pounded jam. No, I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not <laughs> Let's test the waters first when we get comfortable with the pounded jam. Yeah, but you, you're finished. Mm. Come, let me give you chicken. Is this chicken chicken or like... Is there any other type? Kind of, no, could, it's could be a different kind of animal that class it. That chicken. is chicken. Okay. If it was gizzard or whatever. Gizzard. So I would say. But for me, I love, I love pounded jam. I like Gary as well. What's Gary? Um, it's like a different type of thing. It's like more, more Ghanaians mainly eat it. It's what I made the other day. Remember when I, when I was panning it in the pot? Yeah. yeah. What's more popular, Ghanaian or Nigerian food? That's hard to say. Uh, I'm not sure. If you had to pick which one you choose, that's it's depending on what it is. So I can't pick for what it's for, and I I'm not I haven't really branched out. Like I tried the Gusi stew the other day, and um, yeah, I didn't like it. For me, it was it was bitter. But people said that you should try different ones. But my experience for that was just no. <laughs> I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. It was quite bittery. And I went for one on Uber Eats where they say like it's popular, <clears throat> but not everybody likes everything. So. Then it's done. I'm bored now. Hmm. You enjoying it? Yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> She's hungry, y'all. Huh? Should I want some more time jam? No, I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you full? Huh? But you say it's tasteless. Oh, or you just don't nice. like, feel like you're just saving space for the jello. Yeah. Save space for the rice. <clears throat> Have you ever had jello fries? Yeah. Are you have? Where? I don't remember where, but I've had it. Are you sure? At the wedding, wasn't the jello fries there? 
Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You didn't eat it though. You didn't have none. Yeah, but I remember seeing it. Yeah, but you didn't eat it. Yeah. You see how he's <laughs> lying? <laughs> you didn't eat it. You gave it to Dwayne. Dwayne was hungry. Yeah. Made me dish out food and give it to somebody. I don't want this to stop. This is really nice. You are going in on that yam. I like pound of yam. <laughs> la la boy. And then she's like, somebody feed me. <laughs> Rice. I'm not. I'm not sure. It doesn't look like the pellets were. Right. Do you use basmati rice for jollof? That's how the Ghanaians cook it. And then let me wash my taste buds. <laughs> They're jello. The jello for me is not jello. Yeah, what's missing from it? Like jello normally has this twang of spice. It's not too spicy. Mm. The beef is over fried. Yeah. Yeah. It's dark. It's black. Soon. But normally, like stew beef is meant to be like tender. Mm. This is like so when tough, they fry it too long. Mm. I don't even have pepper. What pepper are you tasting? It tastes like a bit of pepper to me. I prefer the pounded yam. For me. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 For me, I think I'm going to finish the pound of yam and I'll leave you with the rice. Enjoyment. <laughs> it 
And this is my jello. I'm gonna have to <clears throat> take it to Auntie Wallace. Take it to Papa Zulu. Papa Zulu is South African. From giraffe and um, zebra. Springbok was nice. I like that. They serve live in there. Can't remember the menu. Well, I know that it was expensive, but I wasn't paying. Hmm. No, it was okay. <laughs> This is more for me. I think out of, me. out of ten, what would you give the pounded yam and the the stew? Pounded yam? I'll give it a five. Really? It's just not my thing, it's just a bit No, I'm talking bit. about both of them together. Oh together I'll give it I'll give it a seven. That's not bad. Wow, people that know him will be like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> eating African food. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes yeah. you've got to step outside yeah. the box, it's not that deep. Once in a blue moon, step out the box. I mean, it's the same way <laughs> how I feel like some Caribbeans are scared to step out of the box, um, but we eat Chinese, we don't know what we're eating, yeah, so yeah. Just the same, the same thing. And what would you give the gel off out of ten? Maybe like eight. So you like the gel off and the beef yeah. stew? The beef stew. I'll give it, I'll give it eight too. It's not bad. Seasoned, doesn't taste. It's not. It doesn't taste too like it tastes. It has moist, has moisture to it. It's it's. It's, like it's properly seasoned, properly cooked, but you said it's been over fried, so. For me, it's over fried. But it's not bad for me. No, that's, that's too much chewing. Mm. Yeah, you're loving it. There's another piece in there, you know. You might as well finish off the rice. Yeah, for me, I'll give the jello rice a five. It doesn't have, I think once you taste proper jello, mm -hmm. like that wasn't jello. Like yeah. jello has like, this has no pepper in it whatsoever. Not even like a little tiny bit. So, um, the beef stew, I think when you when you try stuff, it's so much harder. The beef stew was nice, but it was overcooked. So I would give the beef stew a six. The jello, did I give the jello for rating? I don't, I don't think I did. The jello, I would give it a four. It's not my thing. Now this, <laughs> this I would give, and now nah, I'll give it a nine because it it needs pepper. I think I'm so used to African food being that spicy that did you find did you find this spicy? Yeah. Nah, which is right. So light pepper soup is similar to this, yeah, but it is hot. So if it's hot for me, you would have been sweating. Do you know up. what? Why not? We are coming back and doing light pepper soup. Uh, the, an in tradition, Lala, at the sides. Say hi to YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, she's food, just right? going round like, <laughs> eat me. Hmm. Got more. Yeah, it's a little bit more rice. This is epic. More. Yeah, I don't think it'll be a habit, but you know, it's always good to step out of your comfort zone once in a mm -hmm. while, man. For me. Living on an island for 10 years, there's only one set of food eating there. It's the regular West Indian food, so other kind of food. You're not going to see African food in, in the West Indies, man. You never know. Nah, man, it's not. It's, you, it, it, just takes, it. it just takes some African people to go and move there and start selling. The same way how Chinese moved there 
Like doing Chinese. Do you know what I mean? Well, in the US Virgin Islands, there's not many Africans there. So I doubt that's going to really. You never know. Yeah, yeah, you never know. Never say future, never. Yeah, right now. Now I'm really enjoying this. This is nice. Excuse At me. At least she learned how to actually roll. Yeah, roll I don't know. You was rolling in your palms. I don't know what you were doing. Yet. <laughs> but guys, this is it. Um, a lot of stuff that we wanted to order was unavailable, so we did this wow, wow. this small small one. We came small, we had enjoyment. A little Nigerian mukbang. I know, right? Without talking about a topic. Niger mukbang. How did you find Fanta? Ah, it was nice. Do you think it's better than I'm normal I'm not a Fanta head, but it tastes good. Do you think it's better than normal Fanta? I, don't try, I haven't tried Fanta here yet. Like that's so I would not. What do you mean? When you go in Nando's, would, eh, don't you get Fanta? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, but you know the Fanta and Nando's is nice too. No, but which would you prefer? Like British Fanta or this? That's a hard one. But, mm. I, but I would say that this is more sweeter. Mm. I mean, the, the Fanta, Fanta is nice, but this has more of a sweeter taste to it. So which one would you pick? I'll probably pick this one. Ding ding ding! I can't believe you forgot that you you have Fanta here. No, I feel like it was high season. I was like, what? No, no, it's Fanta. No, you get Fanta. Okay, guys. Like, share, and subscribe. Comment, subscribe and share on the way to a thousand subs. Yep. Soon come, soon come. And um, comment down below what you would like us to do. Yeah, we've got another challenge coming. Oh boy. <laughs> and there are videos that are coming out with him, so those in the pipeline, y'all. Peace out. Stay safe. You say you would.